Hello everyone, my name is Eduardo and I'm here with CGG Geosoftware to show you some tips and tricks in JSON Workbench. Today I'm going to show you how to create faces logs. First you have to create a faces little type on JSON project settings. Go to types and units, edit user defined types and you're going to add a type. Here I'm going to call it oil brine and show I'm gonna edit it and check the categorical data type and I'm gonna edit the categories so so three categories I'm gonna use for oil the value 0 for brine the value 1 and for shale value 2 I'm gonna hit OK and apply I'm also gonna check the colors for this data type that I, cr I created so here are the colors, I'm gonna edit these colors for the brine I'm gonna check the blue and for the shale I'm gonna leave it as light gray I'm gonna open well manage just to show the logs I'm using for the calculations. I'm gonna add a wells. I'm gonna use these two wells, number three and number five. The curves I'm going to use is Vicley and saturation. I'm going to change the color for the saturations to blue. I'm also going to change the scale from 0 to 3. And for the weekly I'm going from minus one to one. Okay. So I'm gonna open analysis function mod. I'm using the well calculations for the well file. I'm gonna add the well number three. And also, I'm going to perform the same calculations for the well number five. So here for the expression, I'm going to use uh, weekly as the first cutoff. So it's weekly is higher than zero point five. Then. else if saturation is higher then 0 0.5 then brine sand else oil gonna hit set for the results, it's a well curve. I'm gonna assign the little type I just created, oil brown shale. For weekly, I'm gonna assign the little type weekly, and for saturation, the little type saturation. I'm gonna hit generate. So it performed calculations, and now I'm gonna add these new created uh, little types for each well. For this well tree, I'm gonna oil brown shale. And this is for the well. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, well, five. I'll branch show you. So here's the curves I just created. You can flatten to the top of the reservoir. You can zoom in. Zoom in. Check if this is good. Uh, you can also change the cutoff values here. 
if you want. Can lower the saturation. Also change the viewplay. Check what's better for your data. So thank you for your time and see you in the next Stupid Tricks.